Hey everyone, and everyone's dog. How you doing? Uh, it's Jake here. I just thought I would do a quick video uh, pertaining to uh, some antennas, or, or, or a antenna, a particular antenna. Uh, what I'm trying to do is uh, I'm trying to do some uh, playing around with uh, different some different antennas to see if I can get some channels uh, I, I currently do not have cable TV I don't I don't purchase it but so I figured I play around with a couple of different antennas and see if I can get some channels going on the go here so I decided to pick this one up first uh, this is the first one I picked up this is from Walmart and it's only about a $16 antenna it's pretty pretty inexpensive um, it claims here that it's supposed to be optimized for HD TV works best within 20 miles and it's supposed to receive uh, digital signals. So there is the antenna there. Um, got her geared up, and um, these particular rabbit ears, or well, we call them rabbit ears, but these particular antennas here are for analog channels. One on this side, and this one here in the middle is supposed to be for digital channel. It's supposed to pick up digital signals. It turns. It's got a very, it's got kind of a light base, so it doesn't doesn't stay down very well. It turns, it turns different ways, and it's also got a 12 position knob here for for um, some fine tuning, fine adjustment. You can, it changes a little bit, as you can see. So works a little bit does a little bit so okay so I, I I am not really uh, I'm not really too too keen on this particular uh, antenna um, I've been fooling around with it for a couple of days and I haven't been able to get very much out of it to be honest with you uh, I think I can get about the same reception of the coat hanger so I just thought I would give you a quick look at this um, I am gonna try out a couple of different antennas to see if I can get some more better reception and maybe a couple more channels um, and I also may uh, try building a homemade antenna to see how that works. Just have a little fun with it, see what I can pick up. So, basically, what what it does here is um, what you got to do here is um, go into here, you go into your antenna setup, click into that, get, hit your auto program, and you can do uh, you know all channels, digital or analog. So if we do another search, here it goes. I'll show you what it what it does now, right quick. It doesn't take very long, about twenty seconds or so, maybe thirty seconds now. Maybe forty five seconds. I don't know, but it doesn't take very long. Anyways. Well, she's on the go. She's fifty percent, she's done she's done searching for analog at fifty percent. And then it goes to digital. For the other fifty percent. So it only picks up the four four uh, analog channels which is three basic channels plus the French one and I've tried this several times I've tried repositioning the uh, this jobby here I tried repositioning that in, in different ways and I still don't get no nothing for digital so there you go so yeah that's why I decided I'm gonna try a few different uh, antennas to see if I can get some I'm gonna try an amplified antenna and see if I can that work better for me so there it is. <laughs> Virtually nothing, eh? <laughs> okay, so... Whoops, no, no, I don't want to do that again. Get out of there, will you? Come on, come on, don't be a silly bug. Okay. So that's it, in a nutshell. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna go out and... I'm gonna probably... I guess I'm gonna take this one back and... and then I'm gonna try a few different ones. And uh, I will keep you updated. I don't want to bore you out too much with antennas. Because I know they're not that exciting. But anyways. Thanks for watching. And I'll uh, keep in touch. I'll be back again real soon. Bye. Oh, and so subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. That's the first time I ever asked you to subscribe. Yeah. Anyways, see you later.